Dr. Henry Skidelsky? Yes. Uh, we're talking to you about vestibular disease, in which Robbie had two years ago, and uh, we're just doing a follow-up checkup. And what would you like to say about this? Go ahead. Well, the main distinction is that people come frequently saying, my dog had a stroke and therefore unable to walk, unable to keep the balance, and so on and so on. And if it was a person, maybe that would have been the case. In a dog, it's a little different. It's not a vascular accident what a stroke is in people, whether no blood supply or too much blood uh, to the brain. It basically, when the nerve in the middle ear do not recognize uh, uh, where the head, where the earth is, and so on and so on, and you lose your balance. And it's a very rewarding disease for us to treat because it doesn't matter what I do, the dog will recover. And I can give any drugs, antibiotic, corticosteroids that probably are not even needed because this is not an inflammatory process and it's not a bacterial infection either of the middle ear. It's just an old age when the nerve do not recognize, do not register the, the balance. And as time goes on, if that dog is provided with the basic tender loving care and support, it will come back. They will recover and live happily ever after. That this, this dog is a, as an as, as, as example. Two years down the road, there is no signs of imbalance or anything else. He recovered within a week and a half on its own without me doing anything, just with the owner. Good love and care. That's right, and, and, and uh, that's what we should do. So please, please, please don't jump your guns, don't put them down, don't write them off. Uh, have trust in Mother Nature, and it will correct itself. Dr. Henry Skudelsky of Animal, um, uh, Ronsonsville Animal Hospital, thank you very much. Uh, you're welcome.